Ay, in my mind, I'm just thinking evil shit Like, should I kill myself for? Should I slip my wrist? Good weed, good vibes, but I'm still feeling pissed On uh, Donald Trump's grave, that's where I'm gonna piss It's a twist Ay. If y'all wanna hear the full thing, y'all gotta check out my Instagram I'm gonna drop that later on, man Y'all be ready for that shit um, But what's up with y'all, man? Good morning, good afternoon, whatever I know it's been a minute it's been a minute, bitch. No, I'm just kidding. Oh, shit. Hold up. Alright, so what's up with y'all? Today, as y'all can see in the title, Backwoods versus the games. You know what I'm saying? I always wanted to do this comparison. Just because, like, people are like, why you buy Backwoods when the games are same quality but cheaper, right? Right? Basically, they say the same thing with the games. Why you buy the games when you could get a backwood? Like, you're just, I don't know. You're just shaming yourself. You know what I'm saying? Basically, it comes down to the decision. Um, whether or not it's a good, I mean, if backwoods are better than the games. You know what I'm saying? So, let's see. So, today, we got Honeyberry Backwoods. And I got this Ziploc one. So I don't want to hear people saying, oh, it's dry, the backwoods, or it's this and that. If you have a Ziploc one, they're a lot better. I'm telling you, the Ziploc ones, compared to the ones that are not Ziploc, they're like fucking dry. You know what I'm saying? I don't, I don't appreciate the dry woods, especially you paying over five bucks for some woods. So these are a three-pack, and at my store, we only they only charge like three-something. Boom. We got the... Um, we both got berry flavors because how you gonna compare another flavor to another flavor? You gotta have the same flavor. We got berry blast, you know, it's close enough to honey berry, so. Um, which one would y'all like me to try first? The game? Okay. Bet. Welcome to Mickey Mouse Clubhouse, head ass. Alright, so today we're gonna, I mean, right now we're gonna try the game. Y'all peep the new jury, man. Y'all know what's up. Hey, so hold on, hold on. Before we start this video, fuck, I didn't bring that shit, bro. That shit gets me mad as hell when I forget to bring something for the video, bro. I swear that shit gets me mad as hell. That shit gets me so mad, bro. Anyway, check out the new drip. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You dig what I'm saying? You dig what I'm saying, man? We ain't on no bullshit. Y'all think I ain't spending racks. Guess what? You wrong. You know what I'm saying? Boom. That's your mama's rent money on my ring. Look at this bracelet. It's almost thick as this chain, boy. Look at this. Uh, you remember I had a little piece like this? I got a fat ass piece now. Look at that whole that whole detail. Uh. All right, let's get it. Oh, I forgot to fill up this hoe. This hoe about to run out on camera, bro. All right, let's get it, man. Let's get it. It's been a minute since I've been on camera, man. I've been, I've been like really busy working on this music. At the same time, like for the past three days, I've been not feeling good. But now I'm better, you know what I'm saying? I'm really good. But past three days, I've been feeling kind of off. Like I had the sniffles and the coughs and shit. You know, sinuses, sickness or whatever. But you ready, guys? Let's get it. Testing time. First hit of the day, <laughs> really good. <coughs> hey, but look, we got um, story time coming. I know y'all like the segment of story time on this channel. So I have a story about how I almost got away from the cops. A lot of y'all know this. It's on Halloween, how I got arrested on Halloween. It's probably the most epic Halloween that I've ever, ever had, you know. So um, if y'all want to hear that, just make sure y'all let me know. I'll definitely post that for y'all. I also got a video called What the Government Doesn't Want Us to Know. I mean, y'all just, y'all let me know, man, because I got these bangers coming, you know. I'm feeling better now. I got core October 1st. Now, I don't know what I'm going to do. I got a vis video shoot on Friday. Then, like, the following week, I got court. <coughs> following week I got court and um, 
So basically, <coughs> if they tell me to do like a month, <coughs> I'll do that, you know, just real quick. But like, if they tell me like six months or something, I'm going to have to do probation because they on some bullshit, you know, like, I ain't even tripping probation, you know, like, I could smoke legal weed and I'll be okay with that, but like, you know, we'll still be lit on the channel, of course, it's just that I'll be on probation for a little bit of my time, but me on probation will have me, my mind straight, you know, it will have my mind set on positive things, you know, more positive than usual. So it could be a win for us, you know what I'm saying, guys? We could, last time I was on probation, I was following it. Dude, I was racking up my money. I was doing everything I was supposed to do, you know what I'm saying? So I'm just probably going to do that because if I'm sitting in jail, I'm just wasting time, and time is money. And you only have a certain amount of time to live, you know what I'm saying? So I don't want to waste my time. I've already wasted so much time in life. So you could taste the product in here. Tastes really good. You know, it's like a um, kind of like a paper. You know how you could taste the product more than a blunt in a paper. Um, it's really it has a good flavor to it. I'll give it that. Now let's talk about the negatives of a of a game. You ever try to roll a fat game and it just rips sometimes? Well, let me tell you, I've had many of those. I've had the white peach uh, games always fuck up on me. The old games like blue, um, game gold, game pineapple, all those are like kind of old. So those most likely to crack on you. But backwoods are old too. And a lot of backwoods, like I remember I used to go to my Valero and the backwoods were always dry there. Like they got late shipments or something like or on the way to Texas, they just really dried up or something. I don't even know. But all I do know is they were dry. But look, so honestly, the games, the bad about it is you can't really roll up a lot. But that's positive for some people because some people don't have a lot of products. So when they use the games, it's kind of an advantage because they have... They, they could they could put less, you know, and still have a good, decent-sized game, which is awesome, you know. Um, now, the backwoods, man. Let's try the backwoods. Let's get it, man. Let's get it. So, um, as for the games, they got a good flavor to them. You know, you don't need a lot of product. Um, they're cheaper. Don't forget that. They are cheaper. They're two for 99 cents, so they're about half the price of the backwoods. Which is really convenient. Um, two is better than one, like like everybody always says. But um, yeah, so let's get on to this backwood. I'm just burning the excess tobacco. I know a lot of people, they like to hit that. But I'm not a tobacco guy. I like natural flavors type shit. Y'all know what I mean, man. You dig what I'm saying, man. You dig what I'm saying, man. <laughs> Off rip. You know, like, if you eat some type of meat, you know what meat it is. Like, say you eat fucking chicken or turkey. You have the determination to decide whether or not that's chicken or turkey. Like, you know and your mind knows which one's chicken and which one's turkey, depending on the flavors. Now, with the backwood, instantly I was hitting the game and I tasted the flavor. Now, the backwood has its own flavor, just like chicken and turkey does. You know what I'm saying? So, backwoods, right when I hit it right now instant you know original familiar taste backward you can't pull up on me with a game and be like this is a backward because off rip if i hit it i could know it's not a backward backwards got that certain taste to it and at first when i first started smoking backwards like my first backward i freaking hated it guys i hated it i told my girl i said hell no nah. How do these musty ass niggas be smoking backwards like it's nothing? I'm like, these niggas be crazy, bro. And it's because I didn't stuff the blunt. You know what I'm saying? And then one day I was like, you know what? I'm going to stuff the blunt. So I stuffed this backwood fat as fuck. And it tasted nasty as shit. I, like, it tastes like I was smoking a cigar. I was like, oh, hell no. Nah. Like, it was just so messed up, like, in a way that I couldn't even understand. And it was just because I was not used to the backwards taste. Now, I guess... 
I thought the backwoods taste was harsh at first, but I don't know. My throat grew into it. Is that even possible? But um, that's pretty much what happened. But I love backwoods because you could roll a fat. And you could roll a whole 3.5 in the backwood, you know. And like on a 100K special, we had 3.5 woods. You know, we had 3.5 woods. All those were 3.5s. All those backwoods. If y'all go check out the 100K special. I do want to do like something special for the 150k, so y'all make sure y'all subscribe and I'll be sure to set something up for the 150k. Also the 200,000 of course, um, we would not fail y'all, I promise y'all that, we would not fail y'all. We getting money, you see you see the drip, you know what I'm saying. Um, I'm just trying to live my best life, you know what I'm saying. I fucking thank all y'all for tuning in, watching the vids, make sure y'all stay tuned because I got a new music video on the way, I got new music on the way. Freestyle on my Instagram coming. Just working hard, you know, all 2018. You know, I've been investing in this, and that's what you got to do. Because if you don't, the next man will. And the next man is going to accomplish more than you. You're going to be in that same spot thinking like, wow, I could have been in that spot, but I decided to sit on my ass. Nope, not me. I've been on the grind. And even if y'all can't see it, even if I'm not showing it, just know that I'm on the grind. Like, don't doubt my hustle, you know what I'm saying? Don't doubt me as a person cuz i'm gonna do everything i want and everything i can to do what i want to do what i do you know what i'm saying damn but anyway so let's compare these two man um to be honest if i had to choose backwards for the rest of your life or the games for the rest of your life now, if you look at both fucking packages, they both have the label of cancer, you know, may cause cancer or whatever. So they're both cancerous. But which one would I want to choose? I'm going to let y'all know right now. If I had unlimited for the rest of my life, it would be the games. It would be the games because sometimes I do get backwards sick, like I smoke too much backwards. But the games, I never had that problem really. But all I do know is I will definitely choose the games over the backwoods. I know y'all probably disagreeing right now. But if think about it. If it was the last thing that you could smoke on earth. Like <clears throat> if you had <clears throat> one pack of backwoods. No, no, never mind. I said that wrong. If you had unlimited backwoods and unlimited games. Which one did y'all choose? I would choose unlimited games. Only because I just like the way they are. And you know, I don't know. But the backwoods, I feel like, I don't know. I don't know, man. Oh, that's a hard decision. This is fucking, this is really, truly hard. You know what I'm saying? But I'm just make it simple. I choose the games. Period. Done. I choose the games. I'm sorry, guys. That's my final decision. I just like the flavor. Like, it has a better flavor. Like, I like the backwoods flavor, don't get me wrong. But it's not an all-the-time agreement. And also, sometimes, like, if you roll a fat backwood or something, it, it, undo, it undoes sometimes. And sometimes you get big stems in your backwoods. Like, I forgot to tell y'all about that negativity. But, um, yeah, the games, not, not so much. You get stems in the games, but it's real thin stems. Not like these big daddy thick stems. Look at this shit. That's a daddy stem. This is a sun stem. I ain't really tripping about the little stamps, but the big stamps, boy, you need some scissors, you need all that. You know, you got me fucked up. But anyway, guys, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. New music on the way. Y'all already know what's up, man. Shit, y'all have a good Saturday, man. Real talk. I'm finna get litty today. Litty like a titty, my friend. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm so fucking, I don't even know what to say, man. I'm gone. I'm gone. I'm gone. It's raining out here, bro. San Antonio, we had a flash flood warning. Are you kidding me? Is you kidding me, weatherman? Damn. Saturday's supposed to be lit. You know what I'm saying?
All right, you guys, that's my final decision. I hope y'all enjoyed this review or whatever. Um, story time segment is next, I believe. So y'all just stay tuned for that. And um, I got y'all, you know what I'm saying? It's going to be lit. I'm going to get into the details with that. You know, I know the last time I told this story, I didn't really get into the details. But I'm going to explain the details now because one person is locked up for life that was with us at the time. Um... And the other person, you know, I don't even talk to no more. Uh, it's just a funny story. I got to explain to y'all, man. This shit is crazy. But basically, I wasn't supposed to be in that position. And I ended up being in that position. Yup. Yup, yup, yup. Hey, dude, we got 141. Hey, 141,000, baby. Let's get it. Let's get it. <laughs> Got a nigga so blazed, and I'm riding through the city with a scar on my face. And I'm in the stool since a kid living the same. Smoking weed and serving fiends, I'm a grind, I'm a prey. That rock up hit that lock up ever since she been a fina. No fucking dance. So I grew up with them schemers. You fucking with my team and you see beam straight out the beamers. Beam straight out the beam. So good and dope up out the window. Pop a beam. I'm talking pinto with slit. I'm sick of Rillo. All in just like a mellow pop. See, I hear that call for shit. I do. They swear they solid, but yellow. I wonder you trippy fellow. Big bitch off on that deuce. Where we known to sip the deuce. Now I'm pulling in that pins, I get more money than they do. And that strap up on my hip, that bitch be stuck up like some glue. It be funny as fuck, them fraud ass rappers gon' duck. I remember days I was stuck, still with your bitch, can't you suck. I realized this wasn't luck, I count my blessings. I told y'all there's much work to do on that song, so there is. But I just had to get it out there for y'all. And I was trying to pay the producer. But I only had a Visa card or some shit like that. But anyway, I'm going to... I think I could load my bank card and then pay him like that. So I'm going to see what's up. But I got to make sure I trust the site or whatever. You know what I'm saying? But like, I tried to pay the producer for that. But um, I had a Visa card and I load the Visa card... <laughs> I even tried to load my, I did try to load my Chase card, but I didn't um, get to go to my bank yet. But I'm going to load my Chase card or whatever and then um, get that going. Because I don't want it to ever be like, I'm on some whole shit. That's why I tell everybody, I'm never on that whole shit. I'm that one real nigga that always does real shit. Like, I'm not trying to be fake or none of that shit. People are like, oh, he trying so hard to be black. No, that's just how I grew up. This is 